Hey, what's up everybody? It's Josh here. I'm here with Coach T and the rest of our coaching team. And we're going to go over this week's AMRAP workout. So for this workout, you're going to have 20 minutes. You're going to have six stations, one exercise per station. And your goal is to get around the room as many times as you can in that 20 seconds, or in that 20 minutes, excuse me. And uh, we'll have a certain number of reps that we'll be performing at each station with each exercise. You ready, team? Ready. Okay, so station number one, we're going to be on the rowers here. Think about power, not speed here. Get those feet locked in. Driving through those heels, deep breath in on the way in, push that air out as you drive out, point those handles right towards your sternum here, squeezing those shoulder blades as you pull and pushing that air out at the end. When you're out of there, when you're done there, we're gonna go for 10 strokes, pull those feet out, we're rotating to the next station. From there, we're coming over to our landmines. We're gonna have Coach Marie here. We're gonna be doing our landmine squat press. So start with those, that bar right there at your chest, squatting down here and then driving up. Deep breath in, push that air out. Notice how she's also coming up to her toes at the end. Now you don't have to go real deep on this squat. So don't think butt to the floor, just think get as low as you feel comfortable and then drive up, throw that bar right to the ceiling. We're gonna be doing five reps here and then we're rotating to the next station. Nice job, Marie. From there, we're coming out to the blue floor where we're gonna be doing some army crawls or slider crawls. So you're gonna get your feet on those sliders, reaching with those arms, wall up those abs nice and tight, reaching with your forearms and your hands. When you get down to the other end, you're gonna turn around and crawl back. You can crawl backwards, you can turn around, you can also switch to our slider crawl, or you can start with our slider crawl with your hands on the sliders, driving with those legs. If the crawls for any reason are a little too challenging or don't feel comfortable, you can bear crawl. You can also do prisoner lunges down and back here, pulling those elbows back, driving up through that front leg. Nice job, KK. Okay. From there, we're coming over to our kettlebell approach set. I need you to be demonstrating our kettlebell clean and squat. So, arch that lower back, chest up, yank that kettlebell up to your chest, and then sit into that squat. So, two movements with this kettlebell. Clean it up to the chest. Deep breath in as you squat down, push that air out as you come back up. When you're cleaning it, deep breath in, push that air out. Deep breath in, push that air out. So two movements here. You're gonna do five reps of both. So clean and squat it five times, and then we're moving on to the next station. Nice job, Seth. From there, we're coming over to our skiers with Coach Matt, and he's doing our, performing our skier here. So think about power, not speed on this one. Coming up to those toes, nice deep breath. Sitting back on those heels, push that air out here, pulling as hard as you can, one rep at a time. You're gonna do 10 reps, and then you're moving over to our last station, which is our power step up. So, if you want, you can hold some weight for this exercise. You can also go without any weight here. Power step up, man. He showed you a power, he showed you a step up. The press, that's okay, man, so excited. We're gonna crush that box as we explode. Up and over here. Think you're doing 10 reps, five on each side. Think about it one breath at a time, getting as high as you can, exploding up off that box, crushing that box, going side to side. If you need to take the impact out, you're just gonna step up one leg at a time. Of course, you can hold some weights here if you really wanna challenge yourself, five and five, and then you're back to where you started, okay? That's our AMRAP workout for this week. Great job, everyone. Great job.